you are. Welcome back to the Big Weekend Show. Now, this one has some controversy brewing. Stick with me. One corporate executive interviews prospective job candidates, and he brings them to the kitchen and offers them a cup of coffee. Then he'll decide whether or not to hire them if they offer to take the cup back to the kitchen at the end of the interview. Those who don't are unlikely to get the job, and now the concept is going viral. But the executive actually talked about it a few years ago on a podcast, saying, quote, it's all about attitude. You can develop skills, you can gain knowledge and experience, but it really does come down to attitude. And the attitude that we talk a lot about is the concept of wash your coffee cup. You want to make sure you got people with a real sense of ownership. That's really what I was looking for. Uh, let me start here and just qualify this for all the viewers at home, and then I'll get to the panel. This is a boring executive trying to make himself sound deep and interesting on a podcast because this is a garbage move. I, I agree. I'll start with I you. I agree. Okay, first and foremost, you could miss such a phenomenal candidate if they don't know this is a thing, if they don't know they even have the option to wash the coffee cup, number one. candidate dodged a bullet. Yeah. Like, no, I'm sorry, sir. Like, I totally understand the concept of, like, being a teammate, uh -huh. treating your workplace like it's your house. Yeah. If you see a piece of trash on the ground, pick it up. I always do that. But first of, first of all, what company has real coffee cups in the kitchen? We what do. No, we don't. We have paper cups. No, but no, 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 interview went into the pantry totally. and started doing dishes totes like totes. i guess i guess okay, i blew it i'm applying I, for a I job as a dishwasher wait i have, wait, I I have a question uh -huh. jimmy yeah <laughs> when you have done outnumbered mm -hmm. where what do you do with your outnumbered mug what do you mean the one that they set right next to you on set one of two things sometimes a person comes around to collect them other times i walk in but it depends and that's the other thing these candidates don't necessarily know the etiquette but guy let me ask you this. are we not supposed to steal those <laughs> because that's what I've been doing. But, <laughs> but seriously, if you were interviewing people, I, wouldn't you be more concerned with what they're putting in that cup? It's like, okay, um, you're perfect in every way, yeah. overqualified, we really need you, uh -huh. but whoop, you left I the cup, yeah. so oh. you're out. <laughs> like, it doesn't seem like the best plan for hiring the best candidate. The other thing that I'll say uh -huh. is, because I think it's a good thing to chip in and do your part and be a good corporate yeah, yeah, citizen yeah. and all that, absolutely. But when you're in a high-stakes job interview, you're nervous. Yeah. Right? You're not your normal self. You're yeah. so focused on what you're saying, it might slip your mind to do something like that. And yeah. it's not a reflection of how you actually behave in real life. So yeah. this seems like a litmus test that's a stupid one. No, fair. I mean, because think about this, Doc. Okay? Let's say you've got the worst interview candidate of your life. But when the interview's over, they watch. They wash everybody's cup in the kitchen. <laughs> like you're hired. Exactly. You know I, 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 yeah, guy I can't spell, can't read, but I, I mean, gotta tell you, these mugs. I can see my reflection I, in. He sexually I, I harassed me during the interview, but he washed <laughs> but, his mugs. But so those you're, mugs. You're in. I think they've kind of got something here, though. I mean, I, maybe when we start interviewing medical school candidates, mm -hmm. we should we should do like a wipe test to see if they actually wash their hands after using the restroom. Because don't you oh want my that gosh. quality in your doctor? Why you is this make sure still a problem after going to the yes. restroom? But again. Just kidding. This is, I think it's actually it very silly. It is 2023. Silly. Let me Wash tell you, hands. my kids at, they're at home, they better be picking up their cups and put them in, in the sink and oh. rinsing them out in the dishwasher. But I, on a job interview, come on, everyone's a little bit nervous. Yeah. You're not acting like yourself. It's not a reflection no. of but again, you as an it's individual. But if again, if that cup belongs to you, if it was a paper cup, I would throw it away. Fair. Right? Like, clean up after yourself, mm -hmm. even when you're out in a restaurant, and even if but they again, tell you, hey, don't, you know, uh -huh. you can leave it. I still, like, try to, like, clean up my mess, right? Because, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm what about this though? being. So, so what about this? <laughs> what about this? What if you don't drink coffee? That's me. Thanks. So Guy Benson really doesn't drink coffee. So what do you do at that point? Do, does he test you on whether or not you wash out your flask at the end of the interview? <laughs> <laughs> or are you just immediately disqualified? Yeah. How about oh, sorry, no coffee. no coffee. I don't trust out. people don't that don't drink that coffee. Guy. You can't come in here. I, this, again, I, I stick by my original theory. I thought you guys might dissuade me, but this is an executive. They all want to sound more fascinating than they are. Okay, this is a boring guy. Well, no one's arguing believe... on his behalf here. No, 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 no. no. But, but what I'm yeah. saying is I, I wanted to now. believe there was another gear to this that maybe I wasn't seeing. Like, I'm open to being wrong is what I'm trying to say. I know I rarely am, but the no. point is I'm willing. We should and have him I'm on. I'm right here. What? 
We should have, have this guy call, on? Yeah, have him call in. We should have him on. No, call but in. I don't know, because he might hate the show. He's like, well, you know, if they swivel in their chair during the commercial breaks, I don't oh, go no. on their show. No. I have a secret test. I've I guess he it. won't come on here, because <laughs> I do this the whole time. Yeah, there you go. On the show, Forget though. about it. I, just for this, I am actually going to dirty up my cup during the commercial break. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.